so if I'm not mistaken, you are here for your face painting, right? Yeah, I, I'm still pretty new to this, but um, I am trying to be as careful as possible with obviously the pandemic and everything going on. Mm-hmm. But you are here for face painting. Okay, good. So, I've been getting a new palette um, after every couple of customers um, because I'm finding that the alcohol that I use to clean this is affecting the paint, so it dries out a little quicker, quicker than I'd want it to. Um, but I do have some really pretty colors today. So is this just like a trial look or are you going somewhere after this? It's a trial. Okay. Great. Just get everything out. Do you know what look you want to have? Are you thinking maybe um, we can do like a skull, like Dia de los Muertos, or can do like a Frankenstein look? I'm not a professional. Just, just trying to get some practice. But what's really cool is that my paint kit comes with some really cool stencils so we can do sort of like a reptile or mermaid scaly skin if you want to go for something not as spooky. Um, <laughs> I don't know if these will be very helpful you as a dolphin and a mermaid if you decide to take that approach. And then I've got like a ton of really cool stars. So maybe if you want to go for, I don't know, a euphoria stardust sort of look. Um, then I've got even more stencils in here. So do you know if you want to do something spooky or you don't know yet? That's okay. No, I don't expect anyone to know. Hmm. So over here we've got some lips and cute little heart, and butterfly. I think I think that's supposed to be Tinkerbell. A unicorn and a horse. Here's more holiday theme. We've got snowflake, cupcake, stars, spooky ghost, um, an evil pumpkin. And we've got some cherries. Don't know what that is. Spade. Man, cross, or an anchor. These are cool because I just have to, like, just take off the sticker. As you can see, it just removes. Like I said, I'm new to this, so it's all really cool to me. Um, and then I would just paint within it so that we can have nice straight lines. Um, let's see what else. More dolphins in USA. More stars. Love. We've got flying bat. Gecko. Skull. This looks like a spider. Particularly a black widow, maybe. Snake. So. 
comes with different options. I think that for you, hmm, I think a sugar skull would be really cool. Yeah, and it won't take too much time, and I don't know, I think it'll look really cool on you, and really pretty, and it's spooky, but still really colorful and enticing. I'm always admirable when I see sugar skull makeup or face painting. You want to try that? Okay, I'm super excited. My beautiful palette. Let's just gently open this up. me three brushes every time, which is really useful. Yeah. Okay. Let's just get this. Um, I need to grab a cup, get some water in it, so that we don't uh, have to paint with dry paint. Okay, so I've actually got this a spooky cup. It's um, it's it, but I can't Pennywise. It's a Pennywise mug. It's pretty spooky, but I feel like it's quite fitting for Halloween makeup. Are you ready? Okay, so I've got some water in here. Okay, so the first thing, it's going to be pretty tedious, but we have to it cold? Yeah. I know since I have such a small brush, it's gonna take a little while just to make sure that we <laughs> layer it on, you know. Can you look up? Yeah. Good. <laughs> Do you 
you feel it drying a little bit, I know it can be a strange feeling. Have you ever had your face painted? Look up again. Yep. You have it. Oh, cool. Well, I am so excited to be the first person <laughs> painting your face. And you get a brand new palette. What more could you ask for? watery because then the brush has a harder time picking it up. Alright, just wanna layer it a little bit. Put this back down. painting guide. We're actually doing this look. So now, looks like we have to go in with black and I'll paint the circles around your eyes. Yeah, like, thinking like right feel on your face. It doesn't feel itchy or anything, right? No? Okay, good. Alright, I'm just going to pack this color onto the brush.
so careful because since it's black, I don't want it to mix with the white and sort of mm, make the white turn to a gray because that'll, <laughs> that'll ruin all the work we just did. I might have to start over. That you are so still. Oh yeah, some of my other people just so jittery, mainly the kids, but that's okay. They just, they're excited, so I get it. They just, they want to see everything I'm doing. So what are your plans then, since, you know, this is our first Halloween where we can't really go anywhere? Do you have anything planned? You know, do like a Zoom call with your friends, or are you going to see some of your friends? What's your plan? Oh, that's, that's going to be fun. Yeah. spider's web. little more 
now we get to kind of create like the cobweb Yeah, I want to do this all the time now. <laughs> Maybe, why not? Where else do we need black? <clears throat> How do you feel about um, maybe not creating like skull teeth, but doing like a black outline on the lips to create like a sort of skull teeth stitched effect? nice lip shape. Yeah, I feel like it makes this all pop out a little bit more. Because they're quite full. Yep. Okay. Should be good. And now we should... Oh, I have to do the little black lines around your eyes. We could fill it in with some pink. Do you like that color? We could do blue or purple. Just around the eye, we put in a nice bright color, kind of like a florally effect. You want to do pink? Okay. All right, well, first... just kind of I'll show you one in with color after. <laughs> Just looks like I'm drawing a really bad flower, but you get the idea. <laughs> okay. This is why I said you can't do too much water, so it's a good thing I did a little trial run on my hand. Sorry, I have a tendency to talk under my breath when I'm focused. Okay, just... Okay, we'll just layer it. Oh, it looks awesome. Okay. Cool. And 
then we'll just do that on the other side and you said pink, right? to fill it in? okay oops, let's make do that again because I banged the table and you said pink, right? to fill it in? okay alright might not need to layer this one since it's a bit more hmm thicker now it's not as runny as it was it's drying up in a good way alright okay cool just clean that Now, just, just cover up the black paint, so we could do, I didn't tell you your options, but we could do mm, red, purple, um, kind of like a navy blue, we've got teal, pink, green, orange, yellow, don't want pink? It's a good choice. I'd want to do that too. Maybe we could do pink and blue. Just pink. Okay. Alright. Let's get this picked up. Alright. And just gently fill that in. the easy part <laughs> get that pink there oh, I think this looks so great I really hope you like it in the end what do I have planned for Halloween? nobody's asked me that yet hmm I'm not sure. I think if it's up to me, <laughs> which it would be, but just touch this up. I think I'd like to just stay home and watch some scary movies and keep it really simple. <laughs> yeah, that's just me though. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not big on going out and I never really have been anyway, so... Especially on Halloween, I get a little nervous, especially since we had the, uh, the clowns <laughs> that were going around everywhere. I thought maybe I'm better off at home. Okay. I'm just gonna do a few little detail things, and, um, I guess at that point, you'll be all done. So, don't mind me, I'll just be getting done what I can. Just do some cool little details on your chin. And around the face. So what's one of your favorite scary movies? 
if you had to pick. Only if you had to. Don't feel too much pressure. <laughs> I know when people ask me my favorite movie in general, I'm like, oh, I don't know, I haven't thought about it. Oh, that's a good one. <laughs> what was the other one you said? Hmm, I don't think I've seen that. No, is it popular? Huh, I'll have to write it down. Remind me it one more time before you go. Honestly, I really like the way it looks. Yeah, I don't I don't think we need to add much more. Um here, I should show you what it looks like if you just look down at this mirror here. Yeah. Do you like it? Oh good, I'm so happy. Yeah, I mean especially since it's my first time, I was really nervous to do it. But you do like it? Yay! Good! Well, since it was just a trial, um, you don't obviously have to worry and I won't charge you the next time because you're my friend, but maybe if you can just post about it on Instagram and tag me or something, so that way I can maybe work on some more people for Halloween. I don't know. Maybe. I think it'd be fun. <laughs> well, I'm really happy you like it. Um, just if you go home and you realize maybe that the paint was cracking or you lost some bi vibrancy or maybe you want to switch up the colors for actual Halloween, just let me know. Yeah, because the consistency I can try and fix with a primer or a moisturizer, depending on how your skin was feeling after, and um, the vibrancy as well. Maybe just mixing some colors or getting some other options. Okay. Well, thanks so much for coming. I can't wait to see you in a week so that we can do it all over again and maybe even add some more detail to make it perfect. Great. All right. Well, I'll see you in a couple days. See you soon.